in my sack. You've got extra eyes, have we? That's right. Well, I'm super grand. Super who? Oh. 96, 97. There we are. Eyes of I I don't believe it. A super grand on a skateboard with extra eyes. Must have been them pickled onions I had last night. Meanwhile, just half a minute later, Super Grand Super Speed is already guttered in Blackthorn College. It looks like a special invitation, Mr. Black. Golly, goshkins. Well, I'd best use my best reading glasses for this. Oh, no, Mr. Black, don't bother. I can read it from here. Mr. Inventor Black. With his latest invention, is warmly invited to exhibit at the Modern Times exhibition in Chiselton later this week. Real super grand. That was word perfect. Golly gosh, kids. Me invited to exhibit at the prestigious Modern Times exhibition. But that's that's a tremendous honour and a very great privilege. But Grandad. Yes, Edison. What is your latest greatest invention? It's outside, tied up to Queen Victoria. Ta -da! Oh no, Mr. Black. Not an old flying machine. That's been thought of loads of times before. It is not a flying machine, Supergram. It is a revolutionary <laughs> form of transport. I call it the skimmer. The skimmer? Yes, yes. It, uh, it, it is a unique vehicle. It, it skims along the road like a car. It skims along the sea like a ship. And it soars into the sky like an aeroplane. But does it actually work, Mr. Black? Well, of course it works. Why shouldn't it? I mean, have you given the skimmer a wee test drive yet? A test drive? Well, no, not actually, but I mean, what, 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 uh -huh. what do you mean? Uh -huh. Super grand. I've never actually driven one myself before, mind, but I've seen lots of car races on the telly. Always looks easy peasy to me. For a spin, then. Super Gran, are you sure you can drive this? Oh, come on, Grandad. Let's get in. All aboard. saw something that made him quiver like a half-set jelly. I must be sick in it for something. First I see a granny with X-ray eyes. Now I'm seeing flying saucers. Better make straight for Chiselton Park, Supergram. I haven't 
got any road tax or number plates for the skimmer yet. <laughs> That's nothing. I haven't got a driving license either. Do you think it'll win first prize in the Modern Times exhibition, though? It's bound to, Grandad. But a fateful moment or two later. Here. Come here a minute. What? Looks like a garden shed from up here. It's a new revolutionary form of transport, Uncle. Belts along roads, zooms in the air, can go anywhere. Anywhere. <laughs> good morning, all. Oh, good morning to you too, Constable. May I see your driving license, certificate of insurance, etc.? <laughs> oh, no, we have nothing like that, laddie. Nothing like that then, eh? Lovely job. By the time I finish for you lot, I'll go with the canteen cup for Constable of the Week. Right then. Just a minute, uh, Constable. Yes, what? <coughs> Are you not uh, Rupert Leakey? Oh, yes, my name is Police Constable 168 Leakey. I thought so. I knew you, Rupert, when you were just a wee bit lad. Me? Nicking sweeties for the tax shop. Mm. I'm glad you've done so well, Rupert. It must have been hard deciding between being a policeman and following a life of crime. Yes, well, I should let you off with a warning this time. That's my Rupert. Just think, Tub, a vehicle like that in one's possession would make one virtually uncatchable. Very likely, Uncle. And who do we know, eh, Tub, who'd pay very highly for such an uncatchable super vehicle? Eh, uh, uh, give up. Why, my old cellmate, Rolly Arufless. Hello. Hey, is that a Roly Roofless Master Crook? Well, it could be. Uh, on the other end, it's it's gonna Campbell. Do you? Campbell. X one with scrubs and number forty nine in the top fifty Crooks chart. 
Oh, well, in that case, uh, what can I do for you? I think you've found the ideal getaway vehicle for your next big job, eh? Yes, but you don't understand, Edison. It, it's the supreme honour in our inventing world to be, to be invited to exhibit in the Modern Times exhibition. I know, Grandad, but just keep still, can't you? Oh, do get a move on. So our genius with a wee tassel is smarter than we thought, eh? Not so smart as the Scunner Campbell. How do I look, Edison? Dashing, debonair, the very quintessence of inventiveness. Just don't forget to take the skimmer with you, Grandad. You know how absent-minded you are. I really have, Inventor Black. Oh! Oh! Oh, what a beastly thing to do. Oh! Scanner. His greatest invention doesn't appear at the Modern Times exhibition. I'll never be taken seriously as an inventor again. Nobody can help me now. Yes, they can, Grandad. Super Grand can. Super Grand! Super Grand! Super Grand! Super Grand! <laughs> Across the rooftops of Chiselton, the freckle-faced voice rang out loud and clear. Chiz, upon which Chiselton stands. But what about my American football competition, Granny? Yeah, nice one, Campbell. Very nice. The perfect getaway vehicle for you, eh, Rolly? Hey, Mr. Ruthless to you. It goes on roads, along rivers, uh, up in the air even. An exceptional vehicle for an exceptional crook. Yes, well, uh A fiver, Mr. Ruthless. 
measly fiver, but that's not what we agreed. All right, you get the rest later, once I've done me big job. Oh, it's the big job, eh? Get in. What? <laughs> Ready when you are then, Clint. Right, Mr. Rufus. You'll be the envy of the entire mobster world, Mr. Rufus. None of our boys in blue will catch us in the skimmer, eh? Come on, get a move on. I, I don't think I've got the hang of it yet, boss. You bungling idiot. Come on, them vaults will be closed in half an hour. Move over, I'll drive it. Chiz covers such a big area, Supergram. My poor skimmer could be stashed anywhere along there. Look, everyone! There it is! Roll on now, boys, till we get to them sort of boats. Could you not possibly fly a little lower, Mr. Rufus? I fear to go, you know it's... But what can we do, Super Gran? They're bound to be using Grand and Skimmer for some evil deeds. Oh, dinner fascist or lassie. I have a classy wheeze up my sleeve. <laughs>
Rupert Nicky of the Chislington Police. And your Nick. Oh. Telephone message received and understood, <laughs> Democrat. That's my boy, Rupert. exhibition this afternoon, Edison. How about that? I'm proud of you, Grandad. Mark you, we wouldn't have got anywhere without Supergram. Right. I wonder what quiet little pursuit she's up to just at the moment. No. You haven't forgotten the team plan? No. no. 40, 60, 28, 2. <laughs> Nothing that she can't do. 